Hello everyone and welcome back to another episode of Royal Park Fine Wine, What's Hot Now with your host, Joe Susu. So this is a 4th of July weekend and I wanted to feature a couple wines that would really complement the holiday. Uh, happy 4th of July to all of you. Uh, we're definitely going to start with a rosé. Uh, Domaine Vitisse Rosé. It's a 2020 at 1399 this is going to be your go-to uh, French rosé. It's from Corsica of France. Um, this is a wine that we have featured for the past four years. We have somewhat exclusivity on it. Um, love, love, love this wine. Every year it gets better and better. And again, this is a French rosé. Talking about, you know, a little bit about rosés. They, um, I gotta get, get, get some of you that kind of shy away from drinking rosés to even just to try it. It's, they are so amazing, especially this time of the year. So pleasant. The nose on it, it is absolutely beautiful nose. Peaches, minerality, um, some citrus, but it has that just floral nose, yet I know this is a dry wine. The acidity is beautiful on this wine. It'll stand up to a lot of great food. So I'm getting that citrus zest. I'm getting blood orange, that sweeter blood orange. Um, it's round and airy, so you, you get that, you know, light, lighter pre presence of wine. I can't say how pleasant this wine is. It's just, um, I, I really enjoy this, uh, this rosé. I can't say enough about it. So food-wise, with this wine, obviously salmon. Pink and pink go really well together. Uh, any, any style of salmon, uh, Cajun, uh, blackened, uh, baked, any kind of salmon would work really, really well with it. I can definitely see myself having a little cookout with maybe grilled sausage, Italian sausage with uh, sauteed onions and peppers, maybe a little, little red sauce on it. This should be really, really, really well um, presented with it. So enough about this wine. The next wine is gonna be your 4th of July weekend barbecue wine. So. This is a wine that I found a few weeks ago and I've been waiting, I, I've been waiting um, to feature this wine. It's called Brassfield Eruption and the name really fits Eruption. This is a uh, 2017, uh, it's a 17.99 bottle of wine, regular price $26 on it, 93 points. Um, the color on this wine, it is absolutely amazing. This is the third bottle that I've already opened just because I'm so impressed with this wine. Again, $17.99 a bottle. Uh, so what's in this wine, it's got Malbec, Petit Syrah, Morvedre, Syrah, and Zinfandel. So this is more of a Rhone style wine, even though it has Zinfandel and that has nothing to do with Rhone but it's more Rhone-ish than anything. But the style of this wine, it is absolutely amazing. Uh, this wine is made by a winemaker that we are very uh, familiar with. Uh, he's absolutely a friend, uh, David Remy uh, of Remy Wines. He's the maker of this wine and we have a lot of respect for his style of wine. So right up front, on the nose, cocoa, cherry, uh, leather, a little bit of smoke. Wow, 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 wow. 
I'm gonna try to limit myself to a few words on this wine. Um, chocolate espresso, um, dense uh, black berries. Again, a little bit of uh, baking soda, uh, black currants. It's got that jammy, jammy berry finish on it. This, I would highly recommend you guys picking some of these up and using them for your weekend with your barbecue ribs, barbecue chicken, burgers, sausage. This should be your picnic wine. It is. It has so much uh, great tannins. It stands up really, really well. Love, love this this wine. Uh, one thing I just had it with uh, over the weekend, and it was absolutely phenomenal, was a grilled flank steak, and I topped it with uh, chimichurri uh, sauce uh, or salsa and it was uh, charbroiled. It was absolutely out of this world. They really paired very well together. And again, I got a lot of respect for the winery, a lot of respect for the winemaker. The blend is odd blend, but in a very good way. For some of you that love the um, Austin, uh, Austin Cabernet that I had a few weeks ago, and that was a huge hit for us. I mean, we're up to lots and lots of cases. We had a lot of people buy it by the case because it was so good. I would definitely uh, have you try this because I think this is in the same ballpark of style and class. Uh, thank you very much. Enjoy your weekend. Happy 4th of July and be safe.